Hello, my name is Lorenzo, and in this video, I'll show you how to reset your message types for Event Espresso 4. This is recommended if you have recently moved from Event Espresso 4 decaf to Event Espresso 4, and the reason why we do this is to introduce some new features that are not currently available in Event Espresso 4 decaf, which is the free version of Event Espresso. So let's get started. The first thing that we'll do is look for Event Espresso within the admins menu, and then we're going to click on messages. And this is going to take us to the messages overview screen. All right, so this screen shows the available message types for Ven Espresso. First thing that we'll do is we'll head over to the screen options tab here, which is in the top right area. And we're going to click on that. And then we're going to increase the pagination from 10 to a higher value, such as 20. And then we're going to click on this apply button here. And the reason why we do this is to so that we can view all of the message types on one page. All right, so let's go ahead and start with the receipt message type. So here's the name of the message type, and here we have an HTML link. So we'll go ahead and click on that, and this is gonna take us to the messages editor. Over here on the right side, there is an extra actions widget, and then there's a button here that says reset templates. Let's go ahead and click on that, and then we'll receive a prompt that our customizations will be lost. And we can go ahead and click on OK. All right, so we just received confirmation that it was reset. So let's go ahead and return to the Messages Overview screen. We can do that by clicking on this Default Message Templates tab. So let's go ahead and do that. All right, so let's move on to the next message type. In this case, it will be invoice. And again, we're going to click on this HTML link here. And this will take us back to the messages editor with this specific invoice loaded. OK, so again, look for the extra actions widget and then click on the reset templates button and then confirm. All right, so it was just reset. So let's go ahead and click on the default message templates tab to take us back to the messages overview screen. And we'll move on to the next message type. So the next message type in this case is payment received. So we'll click on email and then look for the extra actions area and click on the reset templates button and then confirm. All right, so we received confirmation that it was reset. So let's go ahead and head back to the messages overview screen. Again, we can do so by clicking on this default message templates tab. And we'll move on to the next message type, which in this case is refund issued. So we'll click on the email link and then look over here where it says reset templates and click on it and then confirm. And after the confirmation is received, then we'll return back to the default message templates tab. You will want to repeat this step for the remaining templates, which are registration approved, not approved registration, and registration pending payment. Again, the reason why we're doing this is they are some new templates that are introduced in the regular version of Venespresso, as well as new short codes that are not available in the free version. By resetting, you'll be able to access all of the latest features for the messages system. Hope you find this helpful and thanks.